Yeah, we can't let this wind get to us. We can't Wait, be talking okay, about idea. it. Wait, okay, idea. We say that, but we're definitely in the next one. I know. Like, I can guarantee it. Back at camp, we don't do like a ton. We pretty much like, we've been decorating our immunity a lot. So like, that's why I don't have my buff. And someone made a flower crown for it. They don't have <laughs> a little moai dude to decorate, so <laughs> it's instant loss for them. We all keep talking about like, how awful it would be to spend like 30 days doing this because there's just nothing to do. Uh, Lauren made this little like tic-tac-toe board out of some sticks and leaves and bark and we played some tic-tac-toe. I found a bunch of like half nuts. That's so depressing. Those are really good. I'm sorry. It's okay. I'm hungry again. But I don't want to eat now because I'm going to be hungrier later. We're like not eating at all. Um, I think all of us have had like one bite of rice and like a couple beans um, because we're like yeah we just need to like save it um so we're like struggling with that some of us are like wow like i'm actually starting to get really hungry i want food that's not rice and beans i, want, like, I just want more of it so we can eat more i know mm -hmm. we've been sleeping a lot it's pretty comfy As a whole, when we voted out Jake, it was sad, but we all knew that it was probably the best for our tribe, because he was a great person, he just, his personality kind of clashed with the rest of our personalities on the tribe. He was like so aggressive, like his personality, and the whole cracker thing, you know. <laughs> I mean, don't get me wrong, I love you, Jake. It's just nothing personal, just somebody had to go and I feel like he was the most clashing with the majority of the personalities in the tribe. So him leaving didn't leave much of an impact. So we're chilling, we're chilling with that decision. I know someone I don't think anybody has an idol. We all kind of like, went out together and looked, but it was the most like lackluster thing I've ever seen where we all just like wandering around, just like like picking up leaves, that's kind of it. I was hanging by the broken tree. I was just rocking on it to see because there was a little crevice. So I come and looking down and I saw a little crevice. Like, they could hide something. I rocked it, rocked it. I saw the little gray bandana. So I, when everyone else was looking, I uh, crouched down, opened it, took it out, shoved it in my pocket, and walked away. Congratulations, you have found a hidden immunity idol. With this idol in your possession, you are guaranteed immunity at one tribal council of your choosing. This is what we have. Right. No one else, like, I'm not gonna tell anyone, no one else knows. We can't get caught looking, because last time 
they got suspicious about it. Oh, did they? Yeah. I mean, they can look good. I think me and Lauren are pretty good, and I've talked to other people, and every time I try to talk to them, they, and ask them, like, where where's their head at, they always give me, they don't give me a strict answer, so I feel like Lauren is the only one that I can really trust. No one ever split from camp. So I feel like I always have to be there because no one else leaves. How are you feeling, Billy? Um, I'm feeling good. Um, I don't know. I feel like, I think we're not in that point of the game yet where like alliances are super necessary, but it's like. You can obviously tell who's like already trying to do stuff. Yeah. There's like a little bit of tension around camp as far as like our, like the feel of camp. Um, because some people are like already starting to talk about like when we go to a vote, what are we going to do? Um, my, I mean, I'm guilty of that too, but like other people. <laughs> I think the four of us are so pretty. Yeah. You have majority, right? Yeah. Right now, I'm in an alliance with Cody, Bailey, Brian. I don't think I'm in charge right now, but it seems like everyone's asking me questions and telling me what they want to do and asking what I want to do. Lauren. She's, she's talking to us, but you can tell that she's trying to, like, make a move herself. Yeah. I know that I'm in, like, a four-group alliance. Cody, me, Ryan, and, like, Preston, and I think Tally. Um, I think we're looking to vote out Lauren. <laughs> During the confessional, I, like, told them about, like, what Lauren said. Um, yeah. Lauren's, like, weird thing with Preston and I. Mm -hmm. Um, and, yeah. Just spilled all the tea. Yeah. Cody, he's probably like my closest like alliance, like relationship right now. Um, but I know that Lauren isn't the biggest fan of him. If we were going to tribal council, I would definitely send Cody home because like he takes the leadership role, but like I don't know, he doesn't really lead us in the right direction, I feel like. I do not want Lauren to make it to the merge. If she gets no, to the merge, she's she... gonna dominate. Yeah. I just feel very like a threat to Cody. I honestly feel like I would be the next to go if we were in the tribal council, but that might just be me being overly paranoid. We want Caesar and Lauren gone. Yeah, my only worry would be like, if he would actually find an animal, but. But what I'm saying is if he does find it, maybe he'll like play it when we're all voting oh, for yeah, Lauren. Oh yeah, because we would think, yeah. Because he thinks we're gonna vote him out. Yeah. There's also kind of like a multi-layer plan going on with my alliance, so that's exciting. We want to make Caesar think that he's getting voted out. That way, if or when he does find the idol, he plays it, but we're really all going to vote for Lauren because we want her gone first. Come on in, guys. You're ready to get to your next immunity challenge. First things first, Bailey, bring it on up. Immunity, back up for grabs. For today's challenge, three members of your tribe are going to be launching a ball out of a giant slingshot, while the remaining members of the tribes are going to be standing out in a field. If you catch a ball, your tribe gets a point. First team to nine wins immunity. Sound good? All right, I'll give you a minute to strategize and we'll get started. All right, first launch. Survivors ready? Go! Neither tribe caught a ball. Zero, zero. Rotate out. Second launch. Survivors ready? Go! Neither tribe caught their ball. Zero, zero. Next launch, go. Neither tribe caught their ball. Next launch, go. Neither tribe caught their ball. Rotate out. Next launch, go. Next launch, go. Zero, zero. Rotate out. Next launch, go. Neither tribe caught their zero, zero. Next launch, go. Neither tribe caught their ball. All right, playing to five. Playing to five. First. 
five. Survivors ready? Go! Caesar caught one. One point for Solana. Survivors ready? Go! Haley caught one. One point Casaya, one point Solana. Survivors ready? Go! Lauren caught one. That's two points Solana, one point Casaya. Survivors ready? Go! Caesar caught one. That's three for Solana, one for Kasaya. Survivors ready? Go! <laughs> Haley caught one. That is three Solana, two Kasaya. Survivors ready? Go! Ryan caught one for Solana. That's four Solana, two Kasaya. If Solana catches one more, they win immunity. Survivors ready? Go! Ryan catches the ball. That is it. Solana wins immunity. Solana, congratulations. Come on up, get immunity. Solana safe from the vote tonight. You guys can head on back to camp. Kasaya, I got nothing for you. Head on back to camp. We'll see you in a little bit. I really want to know who voted Jake out. Like, who did that? Because whoever like orchestrated that, like, I'm kind of afraid of them. I'm not sure Like, Jake getting voted out? Oh, I know. I was so happy that Jake got voted out. That dude's so annoying. I couldn't stand him. Oh, oh, oh. oh no. Get it, Bailey. No. <laughs> I have zero sympathy for the other tribe. They're super rude. They're like screaming at us at the last challenge, and we didn't appreciate that. Every single challenge so far, the two challenges that have happened, um, they've done this thing where they're just like staring us down. And I think it's like really high school jock of them and it's kind of annoying. I feel like Haley orchestrated the thing against Jake because someone said that she didn't like him like yeah. from the beginning. Like I know that no. I personally don't want her around mm -hmm. for the merge. Yeah. No. Priority as a team is to get Haley off because she is so intense. Like during the last game, like she was like really into it and I was like kind of terrified. I was trying to like block her from catching the ball and she was like, no, and I was like, okay, bye. And we just like need to get her off because she's too strong of a player and I feel like she's very volatile. And I don't want that. And I, when we merge, I don't want her energy in the tribe. I don't think it's a good energy. We got our asses kicked. Yeah, we didn't <laughs> really do good. I feel like it wasn't like anybody's fault. We did our best. And we weren't we super like... behind. It was like, what, 5'3 at the end? Yeah. You know, it sucked, you know? like. We tried our best, you know, I'm gonna accept a lot of the blame for that. I, as I've said, I have the hand-eye coordination of a toddler. I can't catch for shit. You know, you come and you want to be prepared for everything, and I think I've been kind of a poor sport about it, and I need to work on that. But we really tried, we gave it our all, you know. It's just, I don't know, having less people, even five, I don't know, it's like you're weighed down by sandbags or something. I mean, I can give myself some of the blame because, like, I knew I'd be bad, and I, I was. Me with the slingshot, I did not. I broke skin. This is me giving it my all out on the field. Sometimes your all just isn't good enough. That's, that's all I gotta say. Uh, but at the end of the day, we can even go to someone, that's the thing. Yeah. And Honestly, we could all just beat around the bush when I get anywhere, and at that time, we should be. Yeah. I do think that there is a four-person alliance starting to form, ex excluding Kian. Yeah, I don't know. I'm, my mind's blank right now. So. Kian's kind of been on the outs most of the time. He's been like quiet and not really a part of our group.
And three of us is in my life. Yeah, that's why I just don't have anything to register for. So I think so. Yeah. I think so. I think, I don't want to be like too arrogant, but I think I'm in a solid four with uh, Simron, Brooklyn, and Joe. We've kind of been like together since we got to camp. Um, so I'm feeling pretty good. If this alliance is like real and I'm not just being like backstabbed or like tricked or anything, then I think we have a pretty good idea who we would like to send home. Not really like to send home, who is gonna go home. I think Kian is the devil. And it sucks because it's not even, he's definitely, like, he's a cool guy, but yeah, he's just kind of like on the outskirts. Because yeah. yeah. I think the four of us has like have really connected and like yeah. we've created like this four person alliance that I do think can like go far yeah, into the game. Just... It is definitely going to be Cam, this tribal. As much as we don't want to do it, uh, us four are going to stay together. Yeah, I just feel bad, but I feel like the four of us are four, closer. Yeah. And I definitely see him like in the merge going like flipping. Yeah. Like yeah. I think that alliance remains. I feel like we've kind of we've tested that alliance and it's stood these tests as six turns to five turns to four. We're trying to not lose. We're trying to come back. So. We're trying to survive. Ooh. Ooh. I mean. I feel threatened in this moment because the only person they could be talking about is me because I'm right here. I guess it's survive or be survived. Mm -hmm. It just takes three to get a mm -hmm. yeah. So like we have that. But like, I don't know. I don't think I've made any enemies, but no one else has either. So I think it's gonna just come down to like whoever is the least annoying. And in that case, I'm definitely going home because my annoyance level is like up here. So like, yeah, I'm pretty scared. <laughs> it's okay, it's okay. okay. Simran will want to be in the majority, which will be us. <laughs> We're the fantastic four. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, I might just vote myself at this point because like it might be the least painful option because I'm kind of like stressed But it's okay. I probably won't do that. So All right, all right, cheers. Cheers. First food of the day I want to actually not bad the first one. No, I lied The flavor yeah for my alliances. I think I want to say Joe, but I don't know how he feels about it. He's pretty quiet. He hates the scheming, so I don't know about that. I'd rather have one. <laughs> huh? I'd rather have one, so we don't have to do this. Yeah. I think Haley is someone I'm somewhat like very unsure about because she can be very like aggressive sometimes, and then she's very passive. Her like cracking under pressure really. Uh, like, what's it? Got me thinking about her. Right now, I'm just unsure. Like my mind's scattered everywhere. I just have to recoup and talk to everyone and start from scratch again. I know last round, like, people were trying to get me out, so... Well, that was just, just, yeah, just Jay. 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 He, he <laughs> threw your name around a lot. Yeah. And, and he threw my name around a lot, so I'm, like, a nervous yeah. scared. <laughs> no, I really don't know. I'm planning on voting Kian for the only reason that, like, I want to stay in. That's who we could unite against. And I feel like the four of us, like, you, me, Haley, and Simron have like kind of more of like a dynamic. So it doesn't really matter unless he has an immunity idol, which, you know, I don't think he does. It's fine. If I do feel like I have to play, I will play it no matter what, and then that'll be the situation. But if I don't have to play it, if I feel confident that I'm gonna be okay, then I'm just gonna let it play. I'll keep it on. Hello, welcome back. So after you guys voted Jake off last tribal council, you get back to camp, and what are things like? I feel like it was sad to get rid of him, but we all knew that it was the right move for us at the time, and I do think still that it was the right thing for us to do. I see you are all wearing your buffs in the same way. Is that kind of just a way of you guys showing unity within the tribe? We have come here on a united front 
to forgive, to forget, and to move forward. You do come on a united front, but one of you five does have to go home. So how do you figure that out? Nobody deserves to go home, yeah. So then what are you guys basing this vote off of? Uh, <laughs> we said a lot about, well I have I guess, a lot about just consolidation of skill. Like the more skill that we have, as of right now, the better off we're going to be in the next challenge. It is going to be 4v7. So going forward, what are you guys anticipating within the game? I personally think there's going to be a tribe swap happening relatively soon for a merge, like, soon in the future. Would a swap or a merge be beneficial for you guys at this point? No, I don't think it would. Why no. not? We were already at a numbers disadvantage in the beginning. I feel like the two teams or the two tribes right now have a very, not negative, but kind of just like, not the best view of each other. And so kind of merging those groups, especially when we already have less numbers, it's really just going to put a target on any remaining members' backs. I want to stick with these guys, like whoever's left, like I would prefer if they stuck together just because I feel like we've been so united and we've gotten, gotten so close in such a short amount of time. Well, you've all worked very hard to get to this point, but it is time to vote. Kian, you're up. I'll go tally the votes. If anybody has a hidden immunity idol and you want to play it, now would be the time to do so. All right. Once the votes are read, the decision is final. The person voted out will be asked to leave the Tribal Council area immediately. I'll read the votes. First vote, Kian. Next vote, Haley. Third vote, Kian. So the second person voted out of Survivor Oregon, Kian. Kian, that's enough. Please bring me your torch. Kian, tribe is spoken. Time for you to go. Well, now you are down to four. Grab your torches, head on out. Hoped, hoped to go farther, but other than that, someone had to leave. And at the end of the day, I guess, we just lost too many challenges. I understand that I had to go. But uh, a little disappointed in myself. 